India has commissioned the INS Vishakhapatnam, the lead ship of the Vishakhapatnam class destroyer. The Vishakhapatnam class destroyers or P-15 Bravo class or simply P-15B is a class of guided missile destroyers currently being built for the Indian Navy. The P-15B destroyers are modified versions of the earlier Kolkata class destroyers P-15A. The class consists of four vessels Vishakhapatnam, Mormagao, Imphal and Surat. All four are being built by Mazagon Dock Limited or MDL. Noted for being the largest ever destroyers built by India, the P-15B class features substantial improvements in design, technology and stealth over the P-15A class. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes why India's latest indigenously built destroyer, INS Vishakhapatnam, is one of the best in the world. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by War Thunder. If you are, like us, fascinated by military vehicles and technology, I recommend you give War Thunder a try. It's a military vehicle combat game which you can download and play for free on PC, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One with cross-platform support. It has a huge variety of more than 1,200 playable aircraft, tanks, helicopters and ships from the 1930s to the 1990s, which you can take to battle on land, in the air and at sea on more than 80 theaters of war. War Thunder has been kind enough to offer all Defense Updates viewers a special bonus, which will grant you a free premium tank, aircraft or ship and three days of premium account time for registering using our link in the description below. So take the plunge and join more than 20 million players from around the world. The Vishakhapatnam class was designed by the Directorate of Naval Design the Indian Navy's premier organization for designing warships. The P-15B retains a significant amount of its hull design, propulsion systems, sensors and ordnance from its predecessors, the Kolkata class P-15A, to benefit from serial production. However, the P-15B features a lower radar cross-section through modifications in the superstructure and the utilization of radar transparent deck fittings and radar absorbing paint, which makes the vessels difficult to detect. The P 15B destroyers also incorporate newer design elements for improved survivability, sea keeping, stealth, and maneuverability. INS Vishakhapatnam displaces 7,400 tons when fully loaded has speeds in excess of 55 kilometers per hour or around 35 miles per hour and has a range of around 7,400 kilometers or 4,600 miles. The P-15B destroyers feature the Israeli IAI ELM-2248 MF Star S-Band Active Electronically Scanned Array AESA, radar for tracking both air and surface targets. The radar is said to be capable of guiding 24 missiles at once to hit 12 targets. This gives the ship the ability to defend itself against saturation air attacks depending on the number of available missiles. The MF Star is capable of detecting large aerial targets at distances of greater than 300 kilometers or 185 miles and sea skimming cruise missiles at ranges of greater than 25 kilometers or 15 miles. The destroyers are also equipped with the Thales LW08 D band air search radar for tracking and monitoring aerial targets. For underwater surveillance, the destroyers are equipped with the Bell Humsa NG bow sonar and the Bell Nagin active towed array sonar. The destroyers feature the Allura ESM, which is part of the larger Bell Aginata 
Mark II EW suite as their main electronic warfare system. The destroyers also reportedly feature the Deceiver Mark II ECM suite manufactured by Elbit Systems. As for the class's defensive abilities, each destroyer is equipped with two Kvach anti-missile decoy systems for neutralizing aerial threats and the NSTL Marich torpedo countermeasure systems for defense against torpedoes. The primary long-range SAM on board the Vishakhapatnam is the Barak-8, which has been jointly developed by India and Israel. The destroyer is equipped with 32 Barak-8 missiles in four 8-cell VLS, though the number can be increased to 64 as there are spaces available. This 90-kilometer or 56 miles range missile is designed from the start to intercept supersonic cruise missiles, which travel a few meters above the water, which makes it perfect for missile defense. The role of CIWS, or close-in weapon system, is left to the four AK-630, six-barreled, 30-millimeter Gatling guns, which are a last-ditch defense against missiles. It has an effective range of 4 kilometers or 2.5 miles. The main gun is the OTO Malara 76 mm, which has a high rate of fire and the availability of several types of ammunition make it capable of short range anti missile point defense, anti aircraft, anti surface, and ground support. The main ASW anti-submarine weapon is its two twin 533mm torpedo tubes, which can fire long-range, heavyweight torpedoes with a range of up to 40 kilometers or 25 miles. The RBU-6000 rocket launching system complements it. Beyond the horizon, ASW helicopters also provide ASW capability. The Vishakhapatnam has two large hangars, which can support any modern ASW helicopter. Vishakhapatnam's main anti-surface weapon is a battery of 16 vertically launched BrahMos supersonic long-range anti-ship missiles. This is one of the deadliest missile armaments of contemporary warships. It can hit ships at ranges of around 300 kilometers with extreme accuracy. The missile maintains a speed of Mach 2 to 3 throughout its flight, which makes it extremely difficult for even modern defense systems to shoot it down. There is a plan to increase the load with eight additional cells. INS Vishakhapatnam is a platform that possesses the poison, BrahMos, as well as the antidote, Brock 8. A barrage of BrahMos will be hard to defend against, even by a U.S. carrier strike force that has multiple Aegis-enabled destroyers and cruisers. Since the missile is almost impossible to intercept, it will be a major headache for rivals. Even the Chinese Renhai class Type 055 cruiser, which reportedly has a displacement of 13,000 tons and is PLAN's most potent surface combatant, could be crippled by a single BrahMos. Barak 8 is an excellent defensive umbrella that will protect INS Vishakhapatnam from different kinds of threats. A Chinese military specialist, while speaking on Indian naval capabilities in a military show hosted by state broadcaster CCTV channel, identified Barak-8 as a key weapon system. The expert stated that the system can counter the firepower of the People's Liberation Army Navy while operating in the Indian Ocean to a great extent. Some experts believe that Barak-8 is the only air defense system that can reliably intercept 
a supersonic missile like BrahMos. Considering all aspects, it can be said that INS Vishakhapatnam is one of the best in the world. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.